All right, uh, I am in the Safari diesel automatic right over here and uh, this is the new draggy performance box. This is how it comes. Uh, the main device which you need to see basically, this is how it looks and uh, I had unboxed it earlier so it's not in its original uh, packing shape. Now this is what you need to really uh, consider and understand. Uh, the charging wire and of course uh, these uh, metal stick-ons you can put them anywhere it is metal and it's going you got magnet over here so aram se wo chipak jayega a small manual on what to do what not to do i'll just keep this aside okay so uh, the metal is right over here uh, draggy uh, it's got a 500 uh, ma battery and if you use those 3M strips anywhere, you can just put this and it attaches to this metal. So for the time being, I will just be leaving it somewhere where I think it can catch GPS. Uh, you got to download uh, the app, uh, Draggy app and uh, put on your Bluetooth. Post that, just open Draggy. An ad will run, which is uh, understandable, it's okay. Uh, this is the screen, main app screen and uh, click on connect. Connected. You'll see that it's turned to this blue icon over here. It's connected and uh, it takes a while since some satellite data, which I don't know what is it, but I'll let it be. It's completely okay. This takes a couple of seconds and post that uh, it will be ready to use. Yeah. So this is the landing page, which you can see it's 31 degrees outside, probably taking it from here i don't know Let, let's see i'll try to cool it down and uh, other parameters is my altitude 194 meters uh connections are done uh bluetooth is on battery is full i can disconnect or i can go back uh reset so this is my speed right now zero kmph it will go up and down depending on the speeds i do uh the sprints i do uh, i can of course uh custom uh, edit uh, these as well these are the defaults ones 0 to 60 100 whatever quarter mile 100 to 0 braking i can go into custom mode and i can add whatever i want which i'll do at a later stage because i do want to see rolling figures for the safari but i will use the default versions now let me see if uh, this catches i've got a sunroof in the car i'll just keep it over here and let me see if it still catches i'll just uh use to see what happens yeah immediately you can see the speeds going on so even if i don't put it somewhere over here i think my satellites are enough for it to capture uh, the speed comes over here the, the distance i've covered comes in over here and if i start going fast yeah so it's actually responsive if i slow down completely to zero let's see how fast is this this is zero and zero so I think it's pretty pretty much uh, accurate as to what I need you also got a very cool uh, function to record what's uh, happening so in case I you have a mobile holder this is what happens you can see uh, start stop feature I can flick it uh, to capture myself the speed the distance again let me just go through slightly yeah the speed increases the distance covered increases if I start recording this is how to, uh, the screen will look like for example let me just record this and i will uh, use it in the main video so it's it's recording if i start building up on speeds yeah it's recording so i'll definitely show this in the video stop and we come back to a standstill okay there's g-force as well yeah you can see G4 is also coming in over here, the temperature outside, that's my profile. Okay, so that's cool, awesome. And yeah, so I can research it. I'll do a couple of runs in the Safari uh, automatic diesel. I got the modes over here. Economy drive mode activated. Sport drive mode activated. City drive mode activated. Yeah, so I'll be doing these runs in different, different modes uh, to see what happens. So yeah, let's start so reset my ac is off i'll be in the standard mode here we go normal mode Sixty. 
80 100 120 130 break fingers crossed yeah so quarter mile 18.07 uh, 120 100 uh, we improved 100 to 100 9.9 this is so this is genuine 100 it's not speedometer 100 and of course uh, 80 and that so this is was in the normal mode now we'll go on to the other modes okay so now in the economy drive mode activated here we go Eighty, hundred, okay, I will lift off and break. So, yeah, there is a difference. Uh, in normal mode, 0 to 100, genuine was 11.99 seconds. This is 12.65 seconds. Well, let me just take a screenshot and uh, yeah. Coming up next will be the sport mode. All right. Sport drive mode activated. Hey, we go. Yeah, instantly it's quicker. Gear changes are happening at a higher RPM as well. 100 120 Yep, there is a difference. There is a difference. Break, 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 break. Yeah, so 0 to 100 in the normal mode was 11.99. This is 11.54 uh, in the Eco mode, it was 12.65. There is a difference. So the Safari Automatic also has a manual mode. You have flicked the gear lever to the left. This is the manual mode. You can see Sport. So we can change gears uh, yourself or Again, if you don't, don't change the gears, it will eventually upshift. And uh, let's see if there is a difference in this or not. It's reset. I will not be changing gears, but I'm in the sport manual. Let's see if there is any difference. Sixty. Eighty. Hundred. 120 mm, no in fact the normal mode has 0 to 111.99 seconds this is slightly lower than slower than normal mode so yeah the fastest will be to stay in the sport mode in normal drive from here economy drive mode activated sport sport yeah. drive yeah. mode activated so that's about this uh, draggy uh, software and the module right over here remember i had kept this in my cup holder and yet it was catching very accurately now how to order you can go to the link in my description section below it comes uh, from us you need to pay for shipping uh, there will be certain amount of custom duty as well uh, it will take a week or so in my case it took over a week I don't know why it was through UPS uh, so the cost you see on the website you need to just add uh, the shipping uh, remember you have to pay some GST and some custom duties uh, the link you use uh, well uh, that link will lead to the website the same price as you will have on the website without the link as well however if you use my link I'll possibly earn some referral bonus and that just helps me uh, keep my channel alive 
uh, alternatively i might be getting some uh, bulk orders as well if there is a, the demand is high i will uh, shoot your uh, uh, phone number or your email id uh, to me my contact details are in the description section below if the orders are more i will possibly have a bulk order coming in from uh, the draggy guys and uh, it will basically end up benefiting everyone now i am heading to goa for the a class drive and in goa as well i'll be using this again to test the a class for the performance parameters i think it's a lovely lovely uh, useful device which is value for money as well thank you for watching guys bye bye